And here we are for some final thoughts on the deck. So this is the deck list as is. So one of the things that I noticed was I didn't like Asper Sentinel that much. So I want to remove those. So get those out of here. I also thought we had too many things to find with the Snowforce Mystic. Like we have uh, Cranial Plating. We have Badass Gall. We have Kadra Complete. Like all of them fill the same role. And you just don't need three of that effect. It's all just big hitters on artifact. And we just never ended up using cranial plating, so let's get rid of that as well. And that's the big part of it. I ed edited some on the sideboard. Uh, multiple people uh, reminded me that a Vindicator is legal, so these can go. And with that in mind, we ended up here. So this is the list. Now, I removed one of the welding jars. I didn't want to regenerate an artifact ever, so yeah. I added one land, removed... I removed the basic swamp and I replaced the second welding job with a land as well. I added two polluted deltas. The rest stayed the same. Uh, we added two expedition maps. So one of the things I found is that this deck just needs to hit its land drops at all times. And uh, yeah, expedition map is just another enabler to do that. One of the other things I found is that we just have a lot of trouble getting to a point that we can play to was. We're mostly just derping around until we have a huge advantage. And with that in mind, I added another top to foundry, just a mana sink as well. And this also incentivizes us more to get uh, sort of the meek with the Stoneforge Mystic. Uh, yeah, as I already mentioned, multiple people reminded me, Vindicate is legal. I, I, this, this card just feels super old to me. I mean, this was around when I started playing all those, all those years ago, and it's around again. Love this card though, very great success, uh, suggestion, thank you everyone. Uh, so I added two of those in the main as well, over some random slots. And the rest is the same as you could see. So I'm going to zoom out a bit so everybody can see everything. So how do, where is the zoom out button? Do I not get a zoom out? I do not get a zoom out button. Wow. There it is. So this is the entirety of the list. I can make it a bit bigger. I can see. So like this. Uh, one, uh, one other thing also with Expedition Map is it, it helps you find Ursa Saga, which is great. Ursa Saga is just such a fantastic way to keep this deck going. So this is the list. This is where I would start playing this again. I, I will play this again. I had a lot of fun with this. Even though I got cranky and uh, tired towards the end there. Cyborg, this is it. I changed a few things. I added some Jurassic Because I thought we uh, could use with some more discard in some matchups. Like the li Living End matchup we could have used... Uh, a Jurassic or two for the Cascaders. The part of Exile is the same. I added an Elixir of Immortality because I realized we do not have a burn matchup. Uh, this is the same. This is the same. This is the same. I removed one Aether Swan Cannonist. You only need one. The third Vindicates in here. And I kept the Chalices of the Void. So uh, yeah, I think that's the deck for now. Enjoy!